What's happening, Feature Tuesday fans? It's that time again. I'm the MC Jack, and we're coming in with episode 172. Oh, yes! So, in this week's episode, that was a great shit in the video the week, like always. And yeah, that done, come back. We're gonna talk weekend of business. Oh, yes. <laughs> Yeah, you know we loving that triple team bad boy. Oh, just what I needed. Googie. The Premier League on <laughs> Gotcha. <laughs> that was a vids and we welcome them back. So, weekend. Oh god damn, I'm buzzing for this, I can't explain. Usa, 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 calm down Jack. Mate, this shit is going to be off the chain, off the chain. Weekenders are different. You can go to events, you can go to parties, soirees, you can go to shindigs, but weekenders, they're up here mate, fucking up here. You make friendships that... Forged in the fire and flames of the weekenders, they last forever. I'm not even joking. I'm being deadly serious. The first time I met Nizzle, proper ledge, at a weekender. Fucking like, what, eight years later, nine years later, we're still mates. It's nuts. Nuts. Anywho. So I'm not going to say that I'm going to be like chilled out and reserved and like my regular self. I'm not going to say that I'm going to be completely fucking smashed and running around like a nutter. All I'm going to say is I'm bringing a bottle of Captain Morgan's and it's getting done. Ugh. <laughs> I have to buy another bottle. I mean, jeez, you go back a few years, me and the crew, we drank the whole fucking shop. It wasn't even a store. It wasn't even like a little stall. It was a motherfucking shop on site at the, what one was that? Was that the Cornwall one? It was the Cornwall one. It was. Yeah, it definitely was. It was one down in fucking Cornwall. We went down there because we got there late with Webby. And then between us, we all drunk the whole fucking shop dry Jaeger. We must have drunk about 15 bottles of Jaeger between about five of us. And basically about a day and a half. So, yeah, it's, it, it gets pretty nuts at these weekenders. So, I'm looking forward to it. It's not often I get to let my hair down, obviously, in a place with all the peoples and that. Because normally I've got a set and I've got to be all reserved and smart, level-headed. But, weekenders, man, you got some time frame, you know what I mean? Shouts out to Keezy, shouts out to Terry Slam, and I'm praying to the set gods that they chuck me on Friday night, nice and like, start of the night so I can just get it done, get out of the way, and then party! Because that's definitely happening. <laughs> shouts to my fucking partner in crime, DJC, because it's going to be pretty mental. We're going in, we ain't messing around this time. So... It could be Sambuca's AIDS at 10 o'clock in the morning. <laughs> Looking forward to it. Buzzing for it. I can't wait for the weekend. We've got a couple of weeks, crew. That will soon go. So get ready. Get all your plans and preparations in place. Nice alliteration. So, <laughs> mate, I'm so buzzing for this. It's going to be sick. Um, right on the weekend. That's all I'm saying, man. We know how to bust these three words and get out of here. So, I'll start with number one. It's quite an obvious one. Weekend up! Number two, Sam Booker's aid. I, I, I like it. I just it, it felt right. And number three, to finish it off and round it up. It has to be the right moment. It has to be the right thing. It has to be the right that that correct the mundo thing. What is it? Bing. <laughs> Procrastination. Fire! <laughs> anyway, it's everything. It's done. I've checked the list. I've done the lot. It's all gravy. We are got enough week down. We got one week less to the weekend. Come on! Bigging up the crew. Hold down for seven days. I will see you next Tuesday. Hold tight.